one of my absolute favorite places to go hiking or paddling, and that is the Rouge Park. We have paddled up the Rouge River many times, uh, starting down at Lake Ontario and coming up. This time we decided to paddle down, and uh, not only paddle down it, but start a lot further up than we normally would. So we parked the car, uh, not right at the river where we were gonna start, but we, uh, a few minutes drive down the road from uh, where we were stopping. Ben just wanted the challenge of carrying the canoe extra distance that he didn't have to. He didn't instead of want to pull the car over and just have the canoe go right there. So we had to park way far away and hike for, I don't know, a couple hours. Or, uh, okay, I'm exaggerating, but maybe 15 minutes. And uh, just hauled everything along the highway over to the river, found a spot to get in, and, uh, and we launched. So we've paddled up the Rouge River many times. We usually start at the bottom down by Lake Ontario and paddle up. This time we're gonna try paddling down. And we're starting up a little bit further than we normally do. The last time I checked out the river, the water was quite a bit higher and <laughs> it is a lot lower now. So it's gonna be rather interesting to see if we can actually make it all the way. We're probably gonna be taking the canoe out many times to get around some shallow areas. Yeah, this might be more of a walk the canoe down the river. <laughs> <laughs> At least until the bottom. But uh, it's gonna be fun, so let's go. You get in first? Yeah, you get in first, sure. then I'll back yeah. it up a bit. There we go, keep going. Here we go. Go, uh, I guess, to the right of this big rock oh, coming up. I was thinking left. Really? Okay, try left. Just looks deeper down this little channel. Yeah. Are we on the ground now? Nope. There we go. Are we there yet? <laughs> what are we sitting on? I don't know. Okay, well, I'm going to get out. There are many, many spots <laughs> where we simply cannot get down the river. It's just too shallow. What are you sitting on? Rocks. It was pretty much expected because it's getting a little bit late in the spring now. Oh yeah, it looks like it gets shallower up here. <laughs> there was a lot more challenge at the beginning. Uh, just very shallow river at that point. So a lot of... Uh, walking the canoe down the river more than paddling the canoe down the river well yeah. that was fun yeah so uh is that, is that a wrap we're already having to walk the <laughs> canoe down we just started so it gets really shallow a little bit ahead here and i have to uh go around this so this so far has been just me walking in the river hey Tim's i sat shore. for eight seconds How far around can we do we have to go? I don't know because you can see where it starts to get ripply and stuff. I can start to see rocks already. All right, here we attempt to go. Woohoo! Big rock right there. Think we can get down this? Well, I don't know. <laughs> so we have to go through this bit, I think. Oh, watch out, big rock on this side. Oh, we're going on it. Which side is this side? The side I was pointing to. Okay, which way are we going? I thought we were gonna go right to the right. No, there's big rocks. There's big rocks here too. We gotta go. Yeah, I think to the right is the only oh, spot. Oh, there, I see what you're saying, yeah, yeah. Okay, Let's see if we can back up. And slowly if we can.
There is a rock sticking out on the right. We get a little bit more left if we can. Then immediately left. Straight. There's a small gap we might be able to fit through. Maybe not. Maybe we gotta go over there. Okay. <laughs> This isn't so much paddling as it is just pushing <laughs> off the ground. Hey, we made it through there though. Yeah. So I think just to the left of that rock, but there's a big rock right coming up ahead of us. We're stuck again. We gotta get kind of this way. We're stuck on it sideways now. We're gonna backwards. This isn't the right way we wanna go. Close to shore. Ah, uh, this is good. Go a little to the right. Oh. In and out of the canoe, up and down, but that was part of the challenge to see how far up the river we could start from. So this is where we're going to have to portage. We're going to go up uh, across all this gravel. Then we've got to go around. It's where the river has rerouted itself over the last 20 years. It's, it's used to go way around a bend. Now it goes through a different area, but it's like trees galore piled down. There's absolutely no way through it. So we've got a portage around here. Piece of cake. Yeah. Hiked through the bush, through the forest, and found a nice spot that we were able to put back in. After the portage, it was pretty good. There were only a few spots that we had to actually get out and carry the canoe over some shallow areas. But for the most part, the river was a lot deeper and we were able to continue down pretty much the whole way. We stopped for lunch. There was a nice log at this little beach around this point. And uh, we just sat out there eating our lunch. Stopped at a nice uh, picnic spot, nice little sandy area out. I mean, an absolutely spectacular day here. Perfect weather, couldn't ask for anything better. So nice just to sit out. Great spot for a brunch. And now we're gonna head down the river towards Lake Ontario. We did come across some rapids, which are right by the campground at the Rouge Park. We thought we might try and get down them, but once we got to them, we realized there was no way. It was too shallow, we were just hitting the rocks. So we got out, carried the canoe over those rocks. Uh, the worst part is over, now it's the easy part. It's just nice, quiet little canoe paddle the rest of the way. Well, the best part of the paddle is the last part. Down from the campground in, it's wide open, it's nice and calm, it's an easy paddle. It's just a beautiful, peaceful paddle down there. Once you get down to the bottom, it opens up into a big marsh. So we paddled around that a little bit. We saw some geese, some ducks, we saw a heron, uh, lots of things in there. We saw fish jumping and birds catching little fish. It was pretty cool. This is a lot more fun than uh, getting in and out of the canoe every 10 seconds. <laughs> And 
we ended our trip by beaching on the beach right at the shore of Lake Ontario. And so now we are right at Lake Ontario, the very end of the journey. We made it all the way down the river. We're not going to cross the lake today. We'll save that for another day. So we started up where it was difficult to paddle down, mostly walking, and we end up right on the shore of Lake Ontario. Especially on a beautiful day like this, it's just wonderful to be outside. 